What's up guys, gonna talk real quick about my uh, little belt squat setup that I've been using. Um, obviously we don't have a machine here. They take up a lot of room, they're super expensive, so this is a cheap little way to uh, get some belt squat in. Um, it's a very good exercise, isolate the legs, take your lower back out of it. Um, so what I have over there is uh, Iron Mind hip belt. Um, that thing is fucking great. It comes with a ton of different attachments to do what I'm doing, as well as you can attach it to a barbell, both front and back. So you can just use a standard barbell for that. Um, and then I have three plyo boxes over there. So two of them are custom made boxes here. Um, I just got lucky as far as height wise, they work out perfectly for me with the smaller uh, plyo box to put the weight onto um, to hold it there. And then I have just a regular loading pin. Um, so when you set it up, you want to have uh, your bot at the bottom, you want to be just just hovering off the ground. Um, I found that if I try to go all the way to the floor and have it bounce off the floor, it kind of screws me up at the top. Um, I get all off balance um, from the weight hitting. So you want it to be just hovering above the floor when you're at uh, you know parallel. And then uh, pretty much that's it from there. You want to make sure obviously the boxes that you're standing on are super stable. Um, you don't want to be falling over while you have weight attached to you. That would be probably pretty bad. Um, I like to do, uh, I've been doing a lot of higher reps on this, so a lot of volume. And uh, it's been working out really well for me, so uh, give it a try. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, you know, try it out, like I said. Um, definitely a great exercise. I've been doing it on both my squat-focused uh, uh, days and my deadlift days as well. So definitely a great exercise. Give it a try.